The Fort Wayne Museum of Art gained national accreditation for the second time in 2007. It was that year they launched a capital campaign to expand their building and their collection. Absolutely. A decade later, the museum continues to collect, preserve, and present American art that engages and educates audiences. This morning, we're joined by Charles Shepard, the president, CEO, and chief curator of the Fort Wayne Museum of Art. Good morning. Good morning. Good, morning. Good to have to you here. here. What a title. You do it all. <laughs> <laughs> Good to have you. I want to start with a new partner that you have Absolutely. with the University of St. Francis. It sounds wonderful. Well, it's, it's really exciting because we've worked on this for almost four years now, it, and, and it seems impossible to take that long, but the program is museum studies, and students can get uh, a full BA or a minor in this, and the point of the program it differs from, from every other museum studies program in the country. We're looking for students to have all the academic material under their belt, mm -hmm. but also the practical handling so that in fact when they graduate they can walk into a job and do it. And that's a stark contrast to what you find in all the other programs that are out there. Uh, those programs prepare you academically, but you really haven't done anything yet. Uh -huh. Right. So we're going to be quite unique. So this wow. will give them the, the chance to possibly curate a collection or, or an exhibit? Well, curate, it could be marketing, it could be administration, it could be uh, finance. We'll cover every type of work that happens in the museum and prepare them for that. And in a certain, you know, each student's going to have a strength. So right. for somebody, it's going to be curation, and it's going to be that, that they understand art so well, and they know how to put the exhibits together. And for others, it's going to be that they have another skill set mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. will help them use and improve so that they can get a job. Right. And they're actually Absolutely. working in the museum. I mean, yes. yeah, they're yeah, working there. I wanted to make sure we got the that. Big, yeah. The big difference. That's it's a really big, great. Big, big difference. Um, and this doesn't mean, okay, kids are excluded because maybe they're not in college. You have a special program for kids as well. We do. And, and actually, uh, we're part of a national organization, the Scholastic Art and Writing award program mm -hmm. and we have a huge region covers Ohio covers mm -hmm. Indiana and our students perform so well in that in that region that the ones we send to New York to compete with the rest of the regions around the country we're always in the top four or five each wow year. so really and and so that from seventh to twelfth grade that's preparing those students to enter the art world from a uh, studio side of the, wow. the fence. You had an event yesterday where you partnered with Arts United. Tell us about that and how did it go? Well, you know, it went very well and, and Arts United is, is a wonderful group to partner with in the first place. They're just a good group of people. And we've, we've worked hard in the last year to do two exhibits that honor their building, the Performing Arts Center, mm -hmm. and honor the architect, Louis Kahn, who made that building come into being. And so we're, we've launched these events to have people understand better uh, the, the role that Louis Kahn took in this and who Louis Kahn really was. That's it's great. a really wonderful place. And if you haven't been to the Museum of Art, um, to wrap it up, give us the hours and when people and, can check and people everything can be a out. Member too. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. And membership's the smartest way because it gets you in mm -hmm. not only every day free, but it also gets you into all these events for, for uh, no cost. That's always good. Yeah. Uh, we have about 26 shows a year that we do. So if you're wanting to come, if you like art, uh, or if you don't even know you like art, you're going to end up liking art yeah. after <laughs> seeing 26 shows or some version of that. Um, uh, we, we have a particularly nice show up right now of Katya Oxman's prints, and Katya is one of one of now eight artists who've given us a an archive of their work that spans their career, explains who they are, and establishes a legacy for that artist in the museum. And Katya Oxman is on display right now, along with the Louis Kahn shows. That is a must see. Great. Well, thank you so much. And what are the hours today? Um, Ten. Oh, today they are eleven. To five. 11, 11 to 5. 11 to 5. Something okay. fun to check out today. You can see more hours there on your screen. We'll put this story up on Wayne.com a little later on this morning. Up next, I'll have a check of your 10-day forecast.